everybody, it's the boss lady here coming to you today from my office, but it's not set up yet. <laughs> um, currently, I'm going to scoop my chair back here. Currently, um, the office is in transition. Um, the furniture for the office is delayed due to the weather. Um, if you have been following me on Instagram, you know that... Uh, Minnesota has been under the, what, what are they calling it? The polar vortex, um, along with other Midwest um, states and everything. So we have been in a deep freeze. So I, I wasn't going to film at all, but uh, Bossman said I need to do something to try to get myself from being so, I guess you would say sad. Because, you know, we're in the house and so whatever. I was actually going to do a try-on video, but because the office is not done and all of that, I just said, just let me show the items that I got and be done. Let me at least get a video out there because, you know, um, I know everybody who's been following me on Instagram have been really keeping up with everything, but those who are only following me on YouTube, you guys, it has been horrendous. Uh, Tuesday night going into Wednesday, it was um, negative 29 degrees and negative like 53 wind chill. So it was beyond freezing. When I tell you it was horrible, it, it was horrible. I think the last I checked today is Thursday when I'm filming this. And right now it's like negative 8 and I'm not sure of the wind chill. But at least it's going in the right direction. And then here's the thing, by Sunday, we're supposed to be like 40 degrees or 45 or something like that. So, yeah, um, <laughs> I know for some people, they're like 40 degrees, that's still cold. For us, that's a heat wave, let me tell you. So, anyway, I want to show you some items that I picked up. I picked these items up on Sunday. I actually was, um, I was in the process of just wanting to be out the house. Um, it was cold Sunday too, and I forgot what the temp was. It wasn't as cold as it is. It probably was about how it is now, about negative eight. So I wanted to get out the house, so I went to two different places. I went to Tuesday morning. I got one item at Tuesday morning, and then I went to a new place called the Minnesota Home Outlet. From my understanding, we only have three locations. The location I went to was roughly about 30 minutes away, and it was the largest location. And the reason why I went or even found out about it, I happened to be on Facebook, and I saw this advertising. And so I said, hmm, I want to check it out, because they said that they, they were getting in a large shipment of Target clothes and shoes. And so how they were going to do the sale was the first two days, everything was $5. The next two days, everything would be $3. Then two days after that, it would be a dollar. And then after that, whatever was left, they were going to sell at 50 cents. So the day that I went was on a $3 day. So I'm going to show you, I have a big, large bag full of stuff, full of clothes. And then, um, yeah, so let me show you the item from Tuesday morning. Um... You guys know, I think I mentioned on the channel, that I bought a new bed, or we got a new bed in our room, and um, <clears throat> I got a new comforter set, so I got the comforter, the shams, pillows, and bed skirt. Um, we already had sheets, but I went and I bought some new sheets anyway, just because I wanted to, and when I saw the label, I was like, you know what, <laughs> yeah. So, they had a few different sheets, the, in, ranging from like $40 on up. This is a six-piece set, 300 thread count, I believe. And I'm not all into the whole thread count, so don't, don't quote me with that. But what got me was the picture on the front. It says Bellagio at home, and it really made me think of Las Vegas. For those who have been following me for a while, you know Las Vegas is like my home away from home. Um, I just love Vegas. I haven't been now in two years, going into the third year. I think the last time we went, were 2000, went was 2016. But anyway, so this was what the picture looked like on the front. And yes, the sheets are gray. And I know if you guys have been following me for a while, you're like, boss lady, all you buy is gray sheets. Yes, that's all I buy is gray sheets. Um, the colors in my room are gray, black, 
gray, black, and white, I guess you could say. And um, so I just love gray sheets. And when I can find them for a deal, I do. I normally get my sheets at Big Lots, but I couldn't pass this up. I just love the, the picture of the Bellagio. So, yeah. These were regular price. Um, it says, compared to price, $79.99. Tuesday morning was selling them for $39.99 plus tax. I had a $25 gift card that I got from my job. So I only paid like $17 in tax. So that was a great deal from Tuesday morning. That was the only thing I saw there. I went through the entire store, row by row, line by line. That's the only thing I saw that was worth my time. Now, let's get into this Minnesota Home Outlet Store. The first item I'm going to show you is in plastic and this is the only item that I got from Miss Peanut it's just a cream sweater and so I'll take it out of the, the plastic because I left it in here until I did the haul and then I told her you know she can put it away they had a lot of stuff for kids um, by the time I got to Miss Peanut's size because you know she's in juniors it was kind of picked over a little bit and there were so many people in that area I couldn't get in there to even look so um, I actually found this in one of my bands for my size. But it's just a pretty little cream sweater. And she has some camel color um, little boots or little booties. And so I thought this would be cute. She could wear, you know, the booties with this. Now, she will have to wear a uh, tank underneath because of how it's... Um, crocheted or whatever so i'll just find it like a white shirt to go underneath there and then she'll be able to wear this no problem three dollars <laughs> then uh the next two items they're also in plastic guys i got myself brand new pair of jeans regular price 29.99 for three dollars so i got a gray pair and a black pair and I'm not gonna open mine I'm just gonna put mine in the drawer but three dollars are you kidding me brand new and they both were $29.99 yep or no the black ones were 25 the gray ones were $29.99 then I came across this beautiful little jacket and of course I can't wear it right now right now just because it's um it's a little too cold to walk outside in it but um look at this it's like a lamb's wool type of jacket this is how it looks on the back and it's actually a size bigger than what I wear but I was thinking you know when it's not as cold as it is right now I could put on a nice excuse me chunky sweater or something you know some little boots I thought this was really cute. And I was like, I don't have anything that's cream like this. And I just thought, you know, I think I'm going to have to get that for $3. Yes, ma'am. So, yes, I got this for myself. And I don't think the regular price, is it on here? No, it's not on here. Uh, but the brand is Universal Thread. And, excuse me, I got it for $3. So I'm actually, when I go to hang this up, I'm actually going to hang it up in plastic because I don't want it to get dusty and all that stuff. But for three bucks, it's got little pockets. Perfect. Then I picked up these pants. And you guys are going to start noticing a trend with me. And I don't know why, but this is this is my like go-to color for the, the winter time. And I'm trying to think. Somebody, I was watching something and they were saying, you know, don't, you shouldn't. Um, always go to these colors or whatever but anyway <laughs> so I got these pull on pants and they said they're straight pants um, the brand is champion I got a gray pair and they're just you know regular pull on pants um, three dollars that's what they look like and then I also got a black pair and I'm all for black pants. I wear black pants all the time. And that's what they look like. A little string on them. But for three bucks. And these pants, $21.99. See, tag still on it. And I'll show you. $21.99. Hopefully you can see that. I'm not sure. There you go. But three bucks. So I said, uh, yes, please. Thank you. <laughs> so I got these. 
Then, um, I'm getting back to my workout stuff. And I needed some, some stuff for, you know, working out and everything. So I came across these, and these are champion as well. Came across these tanks. And they're made like this. And then the back look like this. $3. And regular price was $18.99. So I got two of these. Because I figured, you know, even if I'm not working out, but I'm at home, you know, spring cleaning, whatever, I got, you know, some decent little tanks and stuff I can put on. As opposed to wearing, like, my good clothes and all that, whatever, I can just, you know, put on something, run to the store real quick, you know, once it gets nice. Yeah. So then I picked up some... What are these called? Mm -mm -mm. Do they tell me what they're called? I don't think so. Anyway, these are like little pull-on capris workout pants. So they look like this, and they're short pants. So you know, but they're not—they're not the kind that fit to the leg. Which for me, I'm okay with that. These were regular price twenty-four ninety-nine. I got two pairs of these. So that's one, and then here's the other. And actually. Oh, no, they're made the same. I was going to say they're made different. But, nope, they're made the same. And they have a hidden pocket on the inside. So, like, say, for instance, I'm out, I'm walking, only need my ID. As opposed to sticking it up top, I can stick it in my little pocket right here on the waistband. So, that's kind of cool, too. So, I got those. And then the last item, when I saw this, I was like, are you kidding me? I wanted this for... Um, Easter. I don't know. It was like when I saw it, this was the first thing I saw actually. And I the first thing I thought about was Easter. And it's a just like a spring spring coat jacket. Like a little overcoat. Um, and I'll try this one on. I don't know if you'll be able to get the full effect because of where the camera's sitting and how I'm sitting. And this was, does it tell me regular price? Let's see. No, it don't tell me regular price. But anyway, I said this is going to be perfect for when, you know, for springtime. So, and it's got little faux pockets. They're not real. Yeah, so they're just little faux pockets. But I thought this would be cute and it closes perfectly. I mean, you know, I can definitely close it. But I want to make sure I have something for spring because, you know, once, um, once springtime comes and I need something for, you know, either work or, um, you know, church, perfect. And I haven't had like a nice little spring jacket, especially for my dress clothes, in a long time. So I thought this was cute for $3. Can you believe it? Three bucks? So... I can't wait to go to this store again. Not only did they have this Target stuff, but they also had home stuff. Like, when I say home stuff, I'm talking, um, I don't think I saw any paint. But they had light fixtures. They had doors. They had furniture. They had appliances. Um, gardening stuff. Um, patio furniture. They had, um, fire pits. Light bulbs, home decor, they had a bunch of things there. TVs, I didn't see computers, um, and I didn't see any desks because I was looking for desks. They had flooring, um, they had like piping systems like for the bathroom and faucets and all this. I mean, they had it. So, um, and of course, they were priced accordingly. You know, some stuff was a bit overpriced, um, but the Target sale, that's what I went for. And I spent $33 on all the stuff I just showed you. I am super excited. Um, I didn't see much in my grandson's size, so I didn't get him anything. But I am going to continue to go to that store and just check things out from time to time. Um, we are now in a process of wanting to do more things with the house. And so, you know, that's just another store that I can put in my rotation for when I'm looking for some, some things for the house. So, I just wanted to show you guys all these items and bring you a haul real quick. Um, I know you probably hear kind of an echo because 
Um, there's actually only, what, one piece, two pieces of furniture in here, and it's not mine, it's Boss Man's. So where you guys are sitting actually is on Boss Man's desk, so across from me. Um, but yeah, so we are still in the process of working on the office, but I wanted to just do a video up here. Uh, we're in the process of doing some things um, in the main part of the house, and so I didn't want to film down there. <laughs> uh, and plus, you know, this just kind of made me feel a little more happier. Uh, I am getting excited, so things just start coming in. I think the last email I got was things are going to start coming in by tomorrow, which is Friday. So I believe I get a delivery Friday, Saturday, and then Monday. So that's awesome. Can't wait. And uh, yeah, so this is where you'll see me sometime, and then you'll see me in another section of the room too so thank you guys for watching thank you for those who have been praying for us to get out of this cold snap that we've been in um and for those who didn't know hey i appreciate you know your thoughts and things anyway sorry there was no talk about tuesday but y'all we was preparing for this cold snap and uh i had to do what i had to do so I did work Monday, Tuesday this week. Wednesday, they ended up closing our offices. I had already put in a take Wednesday off. So I was home Wednesday when I got the um, the message that they did close our office. So I got paid for Wednesday. And now today's Thursday. And I just use PTO because kids have been out of school since Monday. We got snow Sunday night into Monday. And then the cold came like a vengeance. <laughs> so... That be that, but I just wanted to do this video and give you guys a sneak peek. <laughs> we still have some more painting to do up here, um, but I'm I'm happy to be in my space. I can't wait to finish. Um, Boss man has a few other things he wants to do, and my furniture will be here soon. Um, there's another item that he wants for his side of the office and then we have to figure out the actual recording spot and I still have to get um, what is it I still have to get a chair so I have I ordered my my desk I ordered my desk chair and some other things and then I still have to go and order um, my chair for when I record because uh, what I'm sitting on is actually a stool but um, boss man likes a stool I want a real chair so <laughs> anyway y'all need to know all that right <laughs> y'all take care I'll see you on a new video bye bye